Okay, we're uh, going to start here with a, a little bit of an overview um, of the law. And um, as I mentioned, we're going to be looking at, at the law in this class from a media perspective, from a journalism perspective. Um, but there are some just general things that we can say about the law just so that we're all sort of on the same page. Um, one of the things is to sort of illustrate like how important the law is, is if you wanted to write a history of the United States, you could do a really good one by essentially just writing about legal disputes. Um, because legal disputes have more or less been at the center of most of the important things that have happened in this country's 200 uh, plus years. Uh, for example, you know, when the country first started, there was lots of discussion about sedition and whether you were allowed to speak out against the government or not. Um, when we started expanding westward, there were legal disputes about um, land ownership, um, land disputes. During the Industrial Revolution in the late 1800s, when corporations uh, started to, to become more powerful and more pronounced and people started working in huge factories. Um, we started to um, talk about things like regulating corporations, um, antitrust regulation, labor unions. In the 1960s, you know, we had the civil rights movement. Today, we, you know, some of the biggest issues that we're um, talking about and that affect us as a country are legal issues. Um, abortion, gun control, drugs. I mean, these are all legal issues. So what is the law? Well, you can think of the law as sort of a system of rules that govern society. Um, you know, but the law, as we're going to see from, from this module, um, actually comes from a lot of different sources. And so you can kind of think of, of the law as sort of being a fabric that's, that comes from a lot of different places, covers a lot of different things, um, and, and, and affects us in different ways. So the law is sort of a system of rules. It also has mechanisms in place for mediating disputes. So, for example, if you have a dispute with a neighbor or you get in a car wreck with somebody that doesn't have insurance, uh, the law provides a way of dealing with that, as will be discussed in one of the videos uh, after the presentation. Um, so it, it provides a way to handle disputes. It also provides um, methods of punishment. So, for example, if you commit a crime, um, you can be punished under the law, and the law has a way of doing that, of having you have a trial, of you know, putting you in jail, even in some states, putting you to death. So the law regulates citizens, so it regulates all of us. I have to just check my mic real quick. Good, it's on. You can hear me. Um, so the law regulates citizens, and it regulates us in all different ways, like every day as we go through life. Most of us don't think about how the law is regulating us, but it is. Um, you know, you're not allowed to walk down the street naked um, when you get in your car. First of all, you have to have a driver's license. Um, you know, secondly, you have to have insurance. In Ohio, you not only have to have insurance, but you also have to have a little sheet of paper uh, in your car that proves that you have insurance. Uh, you have to put on your seatbelt. Uh, if you drive over the speed limit, you can get a ticket. You might have to go to court. If you're drunk driving, uh, you're going to have to do more than that. You're going to go to court. You're probably going to end up spending some time in jail. You're going to do some community service. Uh, you may even get the pretty uh, yellow and red party plate if you do enough of that. Um, you know, so there are all sorts of, of things that, that, you know, the law affects. Uh, law also, also, the law also regulates corporations, um, especially in industries like the airline industry where, you know, there are all sorts of regulations about airlines and what they have to do, you know, as far as plane maintenance, as far as like how long you're allowed to sit on a runway without taking off, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So the law does a lot of different things. And as I, I mentioned, the law also provides a way of settling disputes. Um, you know, if you have a dispute with a neighbor, um, it can provide a way of settling that. Um, it also settles disputes by providing justice. And in some cases, justice might mean if, you know, somebody killed a family member of yours, 
you see that person tried and put in jail. That could be what justice means. Justice might also mean that you get uh, some amount of money. You know, if some product that you bought exploded and, you know, gave you burns over 90% of your body, um, you know, justice for you might be money. Justice might also be a restraining order, for example, if somebody's stalking you um, and they won't leave you alone. Um, justice might mean that the court issues something that keeps that person away from you. Um, the law generally also, in, in this country especially, limits the rights of government. So the Constitution is set up in such a way that any, um, any power that isn't specifically set out in the Constitution, the government isn't supposed to have. So that is something that, again, we, you know, discuss from time to time, especially um, recently in, in gun control. So the, uh, you know, so when we're looking at these various kinds of laws, um, you know, you're, you're going to be sort of thinking about these things. I mean, and, and different people have different points of view on the law. Um, my political perspective, you know, isn't probably going to come out as much as it sometimes does when I teach the class in person. But I tend to be a liberal. Um, I tend to be somebody who thinks corporations should be more regulated and people should be less regulated. Uh, however, um, I'm also inconsistent in that uh, I do think that, for example, when it comes to guns, I think that we should have at least some more regulations on guns than we have. Um, but, you know, again, I'm not going to belabor that point um, because I know that a lot of people disagree. But, you know, that, that's sort of fine. But the point is, is that we sort of all have our sort of legal um, law points of view as well. So that's an overview of the law.